5 a.m. o'clock, 21st of February, was the day that completely changed my life. I know that I'm not that person that I used to be before Russia uh, started full-scale war in Ukraine, during the missile attacks, during the bombs and explosions. I remember a very special moment when we started to sing Ukrainian songs and it was a very powerful moment for me. It was very uniting to sing your songs, Ukrainian songs, and it heals us in some point and it united us. I came from Kyiv two months ago because I want to spread Ukrainian culture, Ukrainian music, because music is a language that you can understand even without language. You can just feel it. I brought Ukrainian vinyls from 70s and I mix it with uh, new electronic Ukrainian music. I want to show how Ukrainian culture is much more different and much more unique. People are very open to know much more about Ukraine and I think this is my weapon to fight for Ukrainian culture. It's interesting to be working with an artist like Daria because she brings Ukrainian heritage, Ukrainian culture in a form of music and I'm very impressed by her courage to go out despite all the pain that she's going through. People have a new outlook right after she performs. It's extremely inspiring. I met Daria in New York. I recognized her because she is a celebrity in Ukraine. We started talking about Ukraine when, and we realized that there is so much more that we can do. Trying to spread awareness through creating events, through putting together something that can show how many incredible people we have in our country. And we can help Ukrainians understand that they can stand up, they can speak out loud, and they can make their voices heard. We are going to stand with Ukraine and with our people till the very end. I can't carry gun, but I can carry music, I can carry culture, and I can be on stage and perform. It's my way of protesting. Yeah, we had very tough history. We just do our best and we will continue because we are fighting for freedom and I'm so proud to be Ukrainian. Yeah.